Logan Paul teases his boxing comeback. Nessa Barrett reacts to being filmed crying. Plus, Trisha Paytas slams Jada Pinkett Smith over Shane Dawson's drama. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life with your YouTube Roundup, starting with Charlie D'Amelio because just like David Dobrik and Chipotle, her Dunkin' Donuts addiction has finally paid off for her. The TikTok superstar's favorite drink order is now available on the Dunkin' app as the Charlie. Adding to this, Charlie will be taking over the company's social media accounts for the entire month of September. Fans will have the opportunity to get exclusive content as well as 100 bonus points while ordering the drink in the app. But enough of the good news, let's get to some drama because Trisha uploaded a new video ranting about the wave of Shane Dawson backlash in June. Trisha's video is titled The Internet Sucks Without Shane Dawson Big Rant. And throughout the course of it, Ms. Paytas revealed that she believes Shane should be held accountable, but he shouldn't be canceled. She said he is just the effing greatest human in the world and a hate campaign against him earlier this year was so unwarranted and so disgusting and so vile. Adding to this, Trisha also spoke about Jada Pinkett Smith. Recall footage resurfaced of Shane pretending to pleasure himself to a picture of then 11-year-old Willow Smith, and Jada reacted on Twitter and said to Shane Dawson, I'm done with the excuses. Here is what Trisha had to say about the actress. Oh my god, once the internet. Jada Pinkett, really, really, we're really gonna listen. How about worry about your daughter being naked in bed at 13 with her 20-year-old boyfriend on the internet? How about worry about that? How about worry about your fucking cheating husband fucking my male dancers, you know, when they didn't want to? How about talk about that? Switching gears to Nessa Barrett, recently the Hollywood Fix caught the TikTok star crying during a dinner with Josh Richards and she took to social media to react. Nessa said, my mental health issues are serious and personal. Don't record me while I'm going through something and post it please. And finally, let's talk about Logan Paul because following his loss to KSI last year, LP is now teasing his return to the ring. Logan recently spoke with Bad Left Hook and revealed he's planning something special for this winter while simultaneously slamming the ref from his fight with KSI. LP said, I'm excited to hop back in the ring, but win this time around, F you Jack Reese. The press release reportedly named no opponent or fight date, but it claims Logan's return will be part of a major event that will capture the interest of both hardcore and casual fans of the sweet science. And speaking of boxy, Dixie D'Amelio and Addison Rae teamed up with Ryan Garcia and really gave him a beating. Addison Rae and Dixie D'Amelio, this is the Body Shot Challenge. Let's go, 15 seconds. Oh my god! I want to see her. Oh, okay, okay, I'm good, I'm good. That's it. Oh my god. I literally can't help but scream. <laughs> but alright, hit the sub, like, and bell button. Comment if you're excited to see Logan back in the ring, and follow me on social media at Ali Stegnita. Bye, guys.